Okay, this video is a little extension to our background speed for our glide to control the speed of our backgrounds. And we're going to use a variable for it. So what you want to do in variables is create or make a new variable. And I'm going to call mine BG speed. So what we can do now on our stage is when the green flag is clicked, go back to variables set BG speed to and we want it to be 20. Now in our background one script we want glide BG speed seconds instead of 20 and here where it's glide 10 seconds we need to divide BG speed by 2 so we'll get an operator we'll drop that in instead of 10 and it's by 2 so glide BG speed by 2 seconds so now on background 2 we need to drop BG speed into our glide there and if we want to change the speed of our background all we have to do is change it here and it will automatically feed through to here and here and here one more thing, I don't want this really in my game, so on stage I'm going to set BG speed to and I'm going to hide variable BG speed. So it makes no difference to your game at the moment. Although why I've got a big white screen at the start, I have no idea. There we go, that should be the one. But let's test it out. Let's try 30, so this should scroll a bit faster. Okay, let's try something noticeable, let's try 60. Ah, of course, the bigger the number, the slower the background, because it's time in seconds, isn't it? So it's taking longer, so let's try a smaller variable like 10. This should take less time. There we go. So the smaller the number, the faster your backgrounds advance. I'm going to leave mine at 20 for the moment. There we go. Sometimes you have to press the green flag a couple of times. But there we go. Have a go at playing with the variable. 